When following a truck and there is a single lane construction zone ahead, you should 1. Pass very slowly and move ahead of the truck. 2. Pass very quickly and move ahead of the truck. 3. Slow down and stay behind the truck. How can you avoid letting your cell phone distract you while driving? 1. Slow down to 20 miles per hour below the speed limit. 2. Activate the voicemail feature. 3. Hold the phone in your left hand. What is true about signaling at freeway speeds? 1. Start signaling when you move into another lane. 2. You do not have to signal if you do not see other vehicles around. 3. No at least 5 seconds before you change lanes. If you obtain or purchase a vehicle from a private party, you must transfer the ownership within 1. 5 days 2. 10 days 3. 14 days As a general rule, drive more slowly, 1. After overtaking motorcycles, 2. When entering freeway traffic from an on-ramp, 3. Through toll plazas. When you see the sign, you should 1. Be prepared to merge, there are fewer lanes ahead. 2. Slow down, be prepared to stop and yield. 3. Watch out for traffic entering from the right. During the first 12 months with a provisional driver's license and as long as you are under 18, you cannot drive, 1. Between 10 p.m. and 4 a.m. 2. Between 12 p.m. and 6 a.m. 3. Between 11 p.m. and 5 a.m. You should adjust your seat and mirrors, 1. When driving and light conditions change, 2. When driving and road conditions change, 3. Before you drive, Which distance should you keep from an emergency vehicle on its way to an emergency? 1. 100 feet or more. 2. More than 300 feet. 3. 50 feet or more. No signs by their shapes. 
The eight-sided shape is used for 1. Stop signs 2. Yield signs 3. Signs marking no passing zones To prevent drowsy driving on a long trip, you should 1. Keep your eyes focused straight ahead at all times. 2. Get enough sleep before driving. 3. Change lanes frequently to keep alert. This sign means, 1. There is a stop sign ahead. 2. There is a work zone ahead. 3. There is a bus stop ahead. When parking parallel to a curb your curbside wheels MUST not be 1. More than 18 inches from the curb. 2. More than 6 inches from the curb. 3. More than 10 inches from the curb. If your vehicle is equipped with airbags, 1. Seat belts give a better protection if worn behind the back. 2. You must also use your seat belt. 3. Seat belts are not required. When you have a collision, report it to DMV within 10 days, 1. If more than $1,000 in damage was done to the property of any person. 2. Only if the police did not investigate the accident. 3. Unless someone else was at fault. When should you not use your horn? 1. When approaching a blind pedestrian. 2. Because you are angry or upset. 3. All of the above. If you see flashing red lights at a railroad crossing, you must 1. Stop at least 15 feet but not more than 50 feet from the nearest rail. 2. Proceed through the crossing before the train is within 1,500 feet of the crossing. 3. Proceed through the crossing before the train is within 500 feet of the crossing. By looking 10 to 15 seconds ahead on the roadway, 1. You might avoid last minute moves. 2. You eliminate blind spots. 3. You can drive faster than the speed limit. Passing another vehicle on the right on a two-lane, two-way roadway is only allowed if 1. The vehicle you are passing is about to stop. 2. There is a dashed yellow line on your left side. 3. The vehicle you are passing is about to make a left turn.
Which of the following is the best method to improve safety when driving at night? 1. Always look down to the right side of the road. 2. Reduce speed. 3. Always use your high beam headlights. What is a good advice when dealing with driving and social drinking situations? 1. Assign a designated driver. 2. Start drinking early. 3. Drink coffee before driving. Merging onto a road is safest if you 1. Make room by forcing your way into a small gap. 2. Drive on the shoulder until there is an opening. 3. Wait for a large enough gap in traffic. California Zero Tolerance Law 1. Requires all drivers to insure their vehicles. 2. Applies to drivers under 21 years of age. 3. Prohibits all drivers from drinking alcohol. If your rear-wheel drive car starts to skid, you should ease off the gas and 1. Stay off the brake and steer off the road. 2. Brake hard and steer off the road. 3. Stay off the brake and steer in the direction of the skid. Red road reflectors on the pavement mark, 1. A center turn lane. 2. A railroad crossing. 3. A roadway that you cannot enter. For a left turn in a roundabout with multiple lanes, you should 1. Enter in the right lane 2. Enter in any lane 3. Enter in the left lane Which of the following is true about slippery road surfaces? 1. Bridges and overpasses tend to freeze after the rest of the road does. 2. Pavements are not slippery for the first few minutes after a rain starts. 3. On cold, wet days, shade from trees or buildings can hide spots of ice. What does this sign mean? 1. No turns. 2. No outlet. 3. No U-turn. You approach an intersection with a green light. Cross traffic is blocking the intersection. What should you do? 1. Carefully enter the intersection and drive around vehicles in your path. 2. Not enter the intersection. 3. Enter the intersection and use your horn to clear the way.
What should you do when you approach a work zone? 1. Move over to the shoulder. 2. Proceed carefully and obey speed limits. 3. Keep speed and clear the area quickly. You want to make a right turn against a steady red light. You should 1. Signal and wait until the light turns green. 2. Only turn if you have a green turn arrow. 3. Signal, stop and turn only when safe and loud. White broken lines that are larger than normal mark, 1. A lane that ends ahead. 2. A carpool lane. 3. A no passing zone. The three second rule applies to the space of your vehicle, 1. To the sides, 2. In back, 3. Ahead. In this situation, approaching the bicyclist from behind, you should 1. Slow down and be patient. 2. Honk your horn to warn the bicyclist. 3. Pass the bicyclist closely and quickly. This sign means, 1. A temporary detour. 2. Divided highway ends. 3. Crossroad ahead. Slowing down just to look at accidents, road construction, or broken down vehicles by the side of the road, 1. Improves traffic flow. 2. Helps prevent rear-end collisions. 3. Can cause traffic congestion.